Okay, so when you step in the front door, you walk straight into the living room. Give you a quick view right here. You can hear my dishwasher. My dishwasher is running. I don't have anything on this wall yet. Not sure what I want to do. But here's the here's the front door. Right there. I'm trying to walk slow and turn the camera slow, guys, so I don't make it dizzy. <laughs> um, so I've got some pictures on this wall. But I have nothing above the couch yet. I'm not sure what I want to put there. I do want to move the couch down a little bit. So I'm going to wait on that. Decide what I want to do there. And then here's the cat tree stand in the front two windows. And here's the recliner. And I bought myself this housewarming gift for myself. <laughs> I love this little pillow. I looked at it for like three days. And it was the only one there. And I kept looking at it. I'm like, just buy it. Just buy it. So I bought it. So, um, the cat loves the cat tree there. The dogs, they miss their window. They do miss their window to look out. So, here's the living room. And then you walk straight into the kitchen from the living room. And then down this way, it's a hallway. It stays dark. Sorry for the yellow lighting. It stays dark during the day because my kids always have the doors shut. So no light comes in from their windows. So you've got a coat closet here, like a linen closet here. This is my son's room, which I'm not going to show you their rooms, keep their privacy. Then I got another little closet here where I keep all my cleaning supplies, vacuum, all that. Um, my daughter's room. And then you walk straight down to our restroom. It's just a little bathroom. Right there. And then to the left is my room. There's Kitten. The boys are outside in the backyard. Um, <coughs> we have two crates here because the room is smaller than our other room. And then we have two crates there. Um, we were worried they weren't going to fit in here. <laughs> um, but they did. Makes it a little crowded, but we wanted them in the bedroom with us. And you can still open these. Um, closet doors here with the crates there so so anyways kitty you want to say hello kitten you want to say hello yeah he was freaked out when we first moved here um really freaked out and he was sleeping in the dog's crates over here i posted a picture on our facebook page um he was he was freaked out he's been through some moves with us boys haven't been through the moves with us um they did okay. Miggy really whined and was attached to my hip um, the first couple days. But now they're all settled in, they're all calm, and they're doing great. So, yeah, I was worried about them since they'd never moved before, but they're, they're doing great. It's been, what, it's been a week and a day now um, since we moved. So, let me take you into the kitchen now. Okay, the boys are in the house. <laughs> Excuse the lighting, uh, guys. It's kind of dark in the kitchen. Okay, so I'm actually standing in the kitchen area. So when you come through the living room and turn to your right, we have this little dining room area. And that's where I have the boys' dog dishes. And excuse all the stuff on my dinner table. I'm trying to upload videos. Um, trying to get some videos done soon for you guys. So it has this little built-in shelf and cupboard is where I keep all my baking stuff. I've got, I gotta get some labels for these canisters here. And then in the cupboard, I keep all my baking supplies. So I found this uh, sign here. You had me at Wolf at the Christmas tree store. Excuse the noise in the background. It's Miggy playing with a toy, a pig. And then I've got one of my Schnauzer statues a subscriber sent to me. And then this here. And then I found this at the Christmas tree store. I keep some dog biscuits in. A couple little bunnies for Easter. And then that's what I have on the shelf. On a little shelving unit I put here. So 
So like I said, when you walk in from the living room to your right, you see the little dining room area here. And then this way to the left is the kitchen, which has a lot more cupboards, has a pantry right here, which I did not have in the other, well, I had one, but it was so weird shaped that I had to have those cabinets, if you remember, in my dining room. Um, <laughs> but now I have room for everything. I don't have to have extra cabinets. So there's that. May, they like to lay on this rug I put in the middle of the floor when I'm cooking. So lots more counter space too. So I really like it. Give you a view again from this side. So there it is. That's the house. And like I said, I'll um, share a video of my grooming room soon. And I don't know if I'm going to show my husband's basement because he's a realtor and he's always got papers laying around. And I don't want people's address and financial stuff um, to show on camera. <laughs> what are you doing? You want someone to play ball with you? You want someone to play ball with you? Huh? I'll play ball with you. Okay, so hope you guys like this video of the new house. The animals really like the carpet. Even kitten here. Kitten, you like the new carpet? <laughs> he rolls around on it. So look at <laughs> He bites his feet. He's a silly cat. He's about as silly as my dogs. <laughs> Mozzie, you like the new house? Huh? Mozzie. Mati, <laughs> do you like the new house? Yeah, you miss your window. And you miss looking at the baby squirrels, huh? Yeah, he's going to miss that little chipmunk in his window. But anyways, guys, we'll talk to you again soon.